everybody, it's Nicole with Stargazer Luxuries. I am making a holiday soap. This is toffee apple. And it's just going to be a small batch, limited edition. Once it's gone, it's gone. Um, I'm crazy excited about this one. It smells really, really good. And I'm going to go ahead and pour off some green because it does discolor. to go tan so I'm going to leave the rest natural and well I am going to add some gold dust mica other than that I'm going to leave it natural now I'm going to add my fragrance can you hit stop on that timer, please, girls? Okay. This one is, um, you know, you can smell each of the different components, the toffee and the apple, and it just smells really good. It'll be a nice fall fragrance, I think. I'll make sure this is all blended up. fluid. I think the gold is a little looser than the green. But that's right. I don't have any plans for this, just green and toffee. I guess I'm going for a toffee color. Whoa, hello. Actually, my plan is going to be to get the soap in the mold. And that was like a delayed reaction. I just kept pouring, didn't I? I'm trying to get all of my soap done in the next week. What's today? Thursday. So by the end of next week, hoping to have all of my fall and winter soaps made. And that is not a small undertaking because I have like 20 batches I need to do. So I'm doing four batches today. I'm limited on my mold space, molds. I only have two of my big custom molds. I only have two of those. I'm going to get more ordered. It's just been one of those things where other stuff keeps coming up that I need to do and I haven't really made a whole lot of soap this year compared to previous years and I've been getting by just fine until recently. We're doing double shows now so I'll have a booth one place and my husband will have a booth at another place and I'm selling a lot of soap and I'm selling out and my shelves are pretty bare. So before the holidays come, I just need to make sure I have plenty of soap. What do I want to do today? Do I want to just drop swirl that? You know, I think I do. I was thinking about a spoon swirl or running a chopstick through it. I think I'm going to just leave it. Sometimes simple is simple is best. Alright, get this 
cleaned up a little bit. I've kind of made a nice big mess. I'm going to snack this down. And then I saved some green mica for the top. Actually quite a bit of mica. I was thinking it wasn't enough, but whoop. There we go. Okay. bit of gold, a little bit of glitter. I wish I had gold I could just put on my soaps. Real gold. Laying around. Okay, that's random. Anyway, okay, so there's toffee apple. Don't go anywhere. I will have the cutting right after this. Okay, here's toffee apple. Lighting is going to be kind of funny because it's like one o'clock in the morning. Um, it's my daughter's 14th birthday today, and I unmolded this this morning, it's inside, and then I forgot about it. Um, there's another piece on the top, and you can see it's starting to change color. Already, hope you can see that. I won't take a pictures of picture of this for a few days. My nine year old isn't going to be happy that I'm cutting without her, but I'm not going to get her up for this. And I have a farmers market in the morning, and then birthday party for my my daughter. So I'm not going to get a chance to cut this until well, today's Friday. So I won't get a chance to cut this until at least Sunday, and I think it, it, it'll just be too hard then. I don't like to wait that long to cut. This one smells really, really good. I really like it a lot. But this is one of my favorite holiday scents, these caramel, the warmer toffee caramel scents with the fruit. Is that note of sweetness just adds so much to it. Let's see if you can see the swirl is pretty subtle, which is what I wanted. And it should stand out once the soap darkens all the way. It's supposed to go to a toffee color. And the last piece, and this is limited edition toffee apple, and this will be available um, mid October 2016 and available on my websites. My website, stargazerluxuries.com. Thanks for watching.